The drought is a cause for concern for people who call Crofton home as well. Crofton gets a small amount of its water supply from the Cowichan River, and people there say they're worried their taps might run dry. CTV's Jet Bassey has that part of the story. It's another beautiful day in Crofton. It's like California. <laughs> the warm temperature is a surprise for some and a concern for others. The valley hasn't seen rain in months. Actually, by mid-August, we've usually had a, a significant rain that takes the pressure off uh, the low flow in the river and so on. The Cowichan River water levels have depleted. The levels are so low that the catalyst mill may have to cease operations. There may not be enough water to keep the stack smoking. The town of Crofton gets some of its water from the mill's pipeline. The catalyst, I guess, uses most of the water, and I think we come first. So if it gets too short, they're going to have to shut down so we can have water. But the North Cowichan mayor says the Crofton taps will continue to flow. It gets its water indirectly from the Cowichan River through the mill, but it's only, it's less than a 10 percent, uh, way less than 10 percent of, of what the mill requires. So uh, I've, I don't think we're in any danger in Crofton. Catalyst holds a water license for the weir that is managed by the province. The weir water levels are also low. They've been very responsible. They're a good partner in our watershed management. Uh, they're doing everything they can to, to help the river. Uh, really the problem is in the way the water lease is being administered by the province. The mayor wants to see more water stored. And we're talking to them about that and we're very hopeful that for next spring they can make minor adjustments which will allow us to hold back more water for a longer period of time and have it available for the river. In September 2010, North Couch and Municipal Hall enforced strict water restrictions in Crofton during the mill's maintenance. The Municipal Hall says it's too early to apply such extreme water restrictions. It's putting its trust in Mother Nature. Our real hope is that we'll have some kind of a rain next week, that we'll get some more water in the system and uh, we'll avoid a, uh, a shutdown. This time they're not looking for buckets of money to save the mill, but buckets of rain. And they may see it. The forecast calls for showers on Friday. Jeff Bassey, CTV News, Crofton.